guess what project I'm doing today? A uh, table saw? Yeah, and what do you think I'm building? Trailer parts? Yeah, we're gonna build a fence for the trailer. This is gonna be a multi-part series because I'm gonna show this project in a little more detail because I think people might actually wanna build this. Yeah, part one will be cutting all the wood. <laughs> what makes this project special is that I'm using oak for the vertical stakes and maple for the horizontals. See, I happen to get free hardwood, so it's gonna be cool. <laughs> Because all this wood originated as rough sawn lumber, I'm first taking a slice off each end to square it up. Then I turn it around and I cut to length. I left this one small snippet of saw cutting in to show how much I'm obsessing over each cut as each cut counts. This will pay volumes when I go to reassemble later. I'm trying to hold the tolerance of less than an eighth of an inch just to make everything come out looking nice in the end.
If you've never seen a set of blades like this, they're called the stacked dado head cutters. All it is is two special outside blades where the teeth are staggered to the inside and then three chipper pieces that have a blade on each end. There's also spacers that come with the kit that allows you to change the width of this cut from an eighth of an inch all the way up to about seven eighths of an inch. I'm using it in this particular case to just set a really wide cut to remove a mass amount of material, but you can also use these blades for a very specific width of cut. In my case, I'm maxing it out to reduce the number of passes I have to make. What I'm doing is I'm using these blades to remove material from the vertical stakes so I can inset the horizontal rails and glue them together. This makes a really strong joint. Here's the uh, quality control check before I do a million of these. I'm gonna be honest with you, I made 10 of these, two extra in case I screwed up. I'm not gonna make you watch all 10. I'll give you one minute of pure unabashed datoing. By the way, this thing I'm sliding along the table saw, it's called a cross cut slide or a cross cut sled. It just gives you better hold of the material. 